he looks like the dog. Um, or the, he looks like the kid with the dog. Either way, he looks like both of them. All right. I don't know who that Great is. Great movie. Uh, Mr. Peabody. Either Philip Seymour Hoffman. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh, Eric Stoltz. Or... Oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We're friends that laugh. We're friends that shout. Sometimes we don't know what we're talking about. But that won't stop us. Nothing can stop us. Ooh, yeah. Cause I show you use the love. It gets tough. You got to eat pizza late, you know, because there's nothing else open. Like, that's what I did last time. I got a fucking full pizza and just stuffed it in my mouth and then went to sleep. Doesn't matter with your genetics. You got, you got bird genetics, right? Yeah. Immediately, dude. You sleep, you, you eat pizza, and then you sleep on, on the road immediately, dude. And I went to, and we I watched NCIS, dude. I eat pizza. Oh. I watch NCIS. You, literally the worst old? show on the planet. Oh, you're doing it to help you sleep? Uh, no, bro. I do it to laugh, bro. <laughs> I do it to laugh, man. That show is corny, dude. Dude, I, most of the hotels have that uh, where you can log into your Netflix. Yep. So I've been watching Love is Blind, season three. Oof. Love is Blind is the where they're, blind. what is that? Just blind they're blind? Oh, no, no, really? no, no, no. They no. meet. No, it'd be hilarious if they were. No, they meet. They, they get to know yeah. each other on an emotional level. So they can't see what, each other, mm-hmm. what they look like. And then they have to propose to each other. Show and stupid. then, no, it's fantastic. Nah. And then they get out. And they have six weeks together. Mm-mm. And then it's. <laughs> It's fantastic. Wow. And then the one dude who was like, ah, oh, I connected with her. But then they see, he sees yeah. the girl he turned down. She's just a 10. Oh. He's all, damn. And, and he, he goes, then. And he went with the wrong one. Oh, yeah. It happens oh, all the no, time. It's dude. great. And he's like, put my boner. My, yeah. my boner. He's like, well, I'm thinking of my wiener. Oh, no, dude. And, and they like, have, do they have like, actual 10s on it? Oh, yeah. yeah there's some dimes. Really, dude? Yeah. Like, like, his girl's not bad, but the one girl, you're like, ooh, you fucked up. Really? Yeah, that's her with the girl with the curly hair. That's the 10? That's the 10 there. Let's see. Let's see, dude. Make it bigger. We make it bigger. We make it so bigger. Fitness. Oh, wow. So he, he didn't pick her. Uh-huh. Um, and then he picked this other girl. I don't want Nancy. Nancy. Who's, who's oh, not, she's she's attractive, right. too. Yeah. Oh, she ain't bad at no. all. Set of Netflix hitters on her. Oh, all right. Yeah, well, she's okay, not bad. So they have good looking people on her. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Now some aren't, right? Some aren't. Oh, right. No, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh no, yeah. some you're like, I pick Nancy and they come out and she's the warlock. Like, really? oh wow, wow, okay. Ooh, that's it's a... like if you want a best friend, marry, marry, dude. So are they going out still? They're probably gonna break up. I don't know. I don't want to spoil it. I don't know. Well, there. You know, if you're watching the show, you're pretty much spoiling it because you're spoiling your life by watching the show. But a little um, bit. I mean, you watch NCIS though, you're right? So that's yeah. A but we of laugh. We laugh time. at it. We laugh at it. We make fun of it. And I work on my chops as a comedian. By laughing at NCIS? Yeah, but you, you watch this shit like this. You do popcorn. Oh, I'm into it. Oh, no, no. Uh, I hope she picks the right one. <laughs> That's you, dude. And then if they don't pick the right one, you go, oh, no. And you piss your pants. I go, no, 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 no. Oh. Oh, no. What were you saying, Nick? There's one guy, SK. He's Nigerian. I'm not going to try to do the accent. But mm-hmm. he said, what I love about this is that things like race aren't going to play a factor. But... Uh, they talk through the wall and can't see each other. That's hilarious. There's a lot of good good comedy. There's in it. some That's great funny. comedy. Race is not <laughs> going to be a fact. <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, well, wow. th- that shows you, but the best was uh, if you have the stomach for it's love on the uh, love on the spectrum. A very was too, uh, poignant with and, autistic. and sweet. Did I like that. It? Yeah, I, I think that's I, I think that that shows a bit sweet because the, the you know these people are are so optimistic about their situation and they want love, bro. They, they want, love hard. They're, they're not trying to get some pussy. No, no, no. They're, they're trying like, to get. Ma- I love how aggressive they are. Like you'd be like five five minutes. He's like, do you want to get married? Yeah, and they're just like, yeah, yeah. kids, yeah. The Mike Mikey guy or whatever his name is was obsessed uh, when, with dinosaurs. When, when he was just like, when he was like, I had this vision of when we would be a loving family and I would be at her funeral when she dies. And the that's like, well, you're, okay, well you're getting ahead of yourself. He's like, I'm just saying. Yeah, that's that, what he that, does. That made me laugh. My so favorite hard. is the one guy who finally gets that girl and they go on that date. Meet, he, date and he takes on like that LARPing date at the medieval oh, times. Oh, I saw that one. Yeah. And they're, they're literally like at medieval times. He's like, no, no, no. Brad team, yeah, 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 yeah. you can tell. Even she's on the spectrum. She's like, yeah, yeah. 
And then afterwards, she's like, hey, I think we're better as friends. Right, right, right. Like, you <laughs> and know, he's all, what? Yeah. When you're on the spectrum and you're like, we got to be better as friends, then you're the l- person who's less on the spectrum. Because some, some of the people are too much on the spectrum for even the people on the spectrum. Oh, there's yeah. there's levels to this game. Yeah. yeah. But then usually, and there was like a, a few like you know pretty attractive ones, uh-huh. they don't want somebody on the spectrum. Because they think that they got it. Yeah, like they're like, they be. give me a regular dude. Yeah, I don't know, though. If you find somebody that's specifically interesting to you and you're interesting to them, like someone on the spectrum, because, bro, I feel like sometimes I feel like I'm a little bit on the spectrum. You're on the spectrum. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're like an Elon Musk spectrum. Right. So, well, yeah. I mean, not as, you know, as successful, but he, but I just feel like uh, to find somebody specifically on the spectrum that works with your you know, the yin and the yang, it can't be the same or whatever because then it's like too much. But That's what I'm saying. It's yeah. too, mm-hmm. if you're yeah. both on the spectrum. Yeah. But that one dude, that the, the black kid on there on the, the last season, mm. they paired him up. Some girl with Down syndrome. Oh, he yeah. He shows up. He's like, what the fuck? Does that count as on the spectrum? I don't know. I, about that I don't know. But he's mm-hmm. literally like, what the, f- mm-hmm. what are we doing? Uh-huh. They're like, go on that date. He's like, yeah. she's putting peanut butter on her face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, be cool. Eat go it on off. The goddamn date. Eat it off. Yeah, eat it off right now. Be cool. You want. You want that he proposed Netflix to her, money? He did? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Whoa. Yeah, man. Did so they get married? And there's some comedy in that show. Some well, content yeah, I know. is. I know. And that dude went shut the fuck about dinosaurs. Yeah, dinosaurs. And the girl was like, okay. <laughs> dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. That'd be a good name for a dinosaur. A place dinosaurs. dinosaurs. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. Calvin would love that place. Yeah. Can you go to dinosaurs? Go to a dinosaur, buddy. Yeah. Um, my son says he misses me when I go on the road. It breaks my heart. Anyway. <laughs> I, I I won't say who it is. I had a buddy who goes, dude. As long as you Facetime, same as being there. I was like, oh, you're a terrible dad. Yeah. It's, oh, it's, check please. It's crazy you talk to Brian Callen that much. So <laughs> <laughs> check please. Yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, what are you getting? What are you getting? Uh, Calvin Christmas or a couple uh, he, of weeks. We out. went through. You know, what was you just really gotta be cute. dicey. Yeah. You gotta be careful because you don't want to do too over the mm-hmm. top because then he just doesn't appreciate mm-hmm. it. I'm getting an Air 15. Um, <laughs> no, he. <laughs> I am, he, we went through the, you know, they send the magazines in the mail. They do that fucking. The clips? Magazine? <laughs> no, the actual magazines of the toys and shit. They do? Yeah, in the in the real mail. They'll drop them in, dude. Really? Yeah, you haven't checked your mail in years. What kind of magazine? Years, you know? <laughs> what magazine are you still Like getting? a magazine for fucking toys and shit. You're like, so we let him pick something out of Sharper Image. No, no, no. So you fucking, it's a fucking t- t- for toys, dude. You don't remember this as a kid? No. You we wouldn't look at the magazine and be like, I want this? Oh, I did. It was Toys R Us or like KBP, yeah, I think, toys. KBP. What was it, KBP? No, Just KB, KB Toy, Toy Stars. What was KB, it? KB. 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 Um, but, but Calvin, we get it, and we look through it, and he's like, can I read this with you? And then he, he like says, I want that. I want that. It's really cute, and we circle it. He but wants he robot like blocks. 30 toys. Yeah, I know. So we get a few, you know? Yeah. But he wants robot blocks. He wants uh, Gator Golf, which I don't know what the fuck that is, but, is, you know, uh, he's, he keeps saying he wants that, Gator Golf. And then um, he wants... Uh, I, he loves Play Doh, so I'll probably get it. Oh, oh, there. That's what he wants. Okay. Gator Golf. It shoots it back out of the alligator's Cute. top. Oh, that thing's lit. Yeah, Pretty that lit. thing's dope. That's dope. All right, Calvin, it's my turn. That's going to be me. <laughs> um, so he wants Gator Golf, so I'll probably be getting him Gator Golf. I got to get that shit now, though. Uh, yeah, yeah, get on it now. The, my, 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 my son T asked for a PlayStation 5. Already? Yeah. He's six? Yeah. His buddies have it, I guess. They play online. As a six-year-old? Six-year-old, dude. Whoa! I like, I didn't... How about a Darkwing Duck <laughs> stuffed toy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How about a My Pet Monster? Yeah, and he calls you he calls you the F slur. <laughs> dad, dad, yeah. no, dad, don't be a um, yeah, <laughs> dad, you're a pussy. <laughs> get me the get me the fucking PlayStation Five. <laughs> don't be a bitch. He drives away. Don't be a um, bitch. Yeah, um, no, I. I don't know, man. I, I, yeah, I want to get him everything, but then also, like, I don't want him to be spoiled. But it's so hard not to spoil your firstborn, bro. It's because impossible. Because it's like the first time. And then also the grandparents. See, that's the thing. Uh, what I learned, because I get my son one good gift, mm-hmm. because all my family and my girl's family get him a ton uh, of stuff. So if I get him, he doesn't play, it's too much. Yeah. It's too much. Yeah, he's already got too many toys, a lot of toys. Yeah. But it's cool to see him like the toys like i remember like I, I it makes me like it all over again me too do you know what i mean but i want him to like what i like mm. hmm. like you don't like my pet monster buddy? yeah 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 he's like what the fuck yeah he's like about? that's old shit um yeah i love i love seeing him play with toys and uh, you know playing with yeah it's just he loves robots so you know robots i'm gonna get him the robot blocks i'm gonna get him the the di- the the gator golf and I'm going to get him the fucking uh, something else with That's with, a lit-ass Christmas. Yeah, it's a lit Christmas. Christmas. Yeah, we have I only got one gift. When I was a kid, I might yeah. have one gift. That's how it should be. 
That's our tip. You should get one gift. I it's mean, it's quite early. Nick, you didn't get gifts or what? I, I'd get, I get one decent one. Uh, felt bad. Grandma sacrificed. She worked hard. Yeah, once you get your gift. Yeah, I feel bad if someone gets me a good gift. Mm-hmm. It's also like, what do you, what, what, not what, me. Like, get me your, good gifts. Like, what your <laughs> wife gets you? It's like, yeah, you know, I know. what I'm saying? It's I like, tell her. I was like, don't spend anything. That's she, what I told she her. Does. I tell her. Listen, if yeah. something I want, you just buy it. Mm-hmm. Just don't give me. Yeah, anything. yeah. Because you're gonna buy something and try and surprise me. I'm not gonna want it. Now you hurt your feelings. Yeah, take it back. It's waste my time. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. I I, I think uh, I don't know. It, they, the fucking money you make on these stores make on Christmas though. It's just like, oh, it's just insane, so. dude. It's insane. Speaking of Christmas, you know what makes a great holiday gift? Crystalia merch. Oh, do you're we, not lying. Do you go to crystaliamerch.com. What would you crystalia.com for merch? Do we have something that we're, that came out? We're, we're yeah, we're, we're dropping okay, okay, some okay. ugly sweaters. Right, cool. Some right, cool. uh, so some we already ugly dropped those golden hour sweaters. Um, we're going to. We're going to. Always with that one. It's always the kink, the kink, kink one. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be in San Diego. I'm going to be in uh, Jacksonville, Lakeland, Florida, Brea, California, Portland, uh, Seattle, and uh, San Antonio, Sugarland, New York, New York, New Orleans, Providence, Rhode Island, and Chicago. I'll stop there. God, you're stressing me but out. Like you Christine have all your com. dates already for 2023. Dude, I, I, I know I'm going. Daddy's going UK next year. Daddy's going UK 2023. I'm Where? Going when? Back. You don't know yet? I don't know yet. We're playing it now. I know I'm in Florida. Okay. General, general. Cool. Yeah, we're figuring it out, right, dude. Right. But you have dates in January? No, not yet? February. February, February. right now. We're I'm sure January. we have January. Chilling? No, hell no. I can't chill. I'll die. Yeah, yeah, I know. No, hell no. I know, Freak bro. Out. I know. Daddy bro. has to work. All right, all right, all right. Uh, let's take a little break, fam. Uh, Chris D'Elia went to the bathroom, but look who I brought in. Hey, everybody. Eric, what are you doing here? You know, I'm here to tell you guys about, I'm going to be at the Comedy Zone Greensboro, North Carolina, January 3rd, uh, what is it? 13th through the 15th, and I'm going to be in Montana, Great Falls, Montana, the Newberry, February 25th. That you sounds know? fantastic. But you know what else I'm also here to talk about? What's that? Hello Fresh. Yeah, I'm here to talk about. I'll be in Tampa end of January, oh, but yeah. I love Hello Fresh too. I'm he- <laughs> also here to talk about Hello Fresh. Tampa first date of 2023, end of January. Get your tickets. Tampa, America's, Florida. America's number one meal kit. Oh, you're talking about Hello Fresh. Mm-hmm. Yep, it's the most festive time of the year, and Hello Fresh is here to help make the most of every moment with the fam. From holiday hosting to dinners, during busy weeknights, you can count on Hello Fresh to deliver fresh ingredients and seasonal recipes. I've actually used Hello Fresh. Me too. And it is great. You know, when you just you want, you want a nice portioned meal, boom, you pop it in, it's ready to go. Yeah, and also, tis the season save money. HelloFresh is cheaper than a grocery store, all right? 25% less expensive than takeout, so you can use those savings to buy the perfect gift or maybe a little gift for yourself, man. Treat yourself. Yeah, get you some. Quality is HelloFresh's number one priority. Ingredients travel from the farm to your home in less than seven days, so you know it's fresh, bro. All right? So go to HelloFresh.com slash King18. Use the code King18. You get 18 free meals plus free shipping. All right? Go to HelloFresh.com slash King18. Use code King18 for 18 free meals plus free shipping. HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit. Stay fresh and enjoy. Listen, Eric, I know, you, I know you see me. I got cans around all the time. Everyone's, know, everyone's like, what is it? What is it? It's the way I get nicotine from the best company on the planet. We're talking about Rogue. And if you guys watch anything I do, you know I got Rogue on me at all freaking times. I use their pouches every single day. I use them on podcasts, at the gym, comedy clubs. When I'm flying, there's no restrictions. And I love myself. The, right now, I got the lemon. I love the mango. My favorite's the apple. But they got berry, peppermint. All right? You can get three or six milligrams. I do the six i'm no punk all right but you know what if you want to try nicotine maybe you don't like the pouches they also make it in other ways we're talking about gum tablets lozenges all right they got it all man i love it i asked them to be part of this show because i use rogue more than any other product i love them if you want to try pouches like me or the gums or tablets go to rogue nicotine.com use the code rogue 20 for 20 percent off your order again that's rogue 20 for 20 percent off your order of the best of the best it's the best nicotine on the planet. We're talking about rogue nicotine, baby. Underage sale prohibited. Warning, this product contains nicotine. Nicotine is an addictive chemical. For more information, visit roguenicotine.com. Now let's get back to the program. Um, Wait, Jin, you had a good Christmas, I assume, because you had a brother. You had your brother. I, your I have a great family, so I was yeah, always Yeah, Jin comes from a good awesome. family. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a yeah. Dude, well, I hate people with good family. I have a great family. Yeah, you do. Yeah, my family's... <laughs> 
banging, bro. And why are you all weird? <laughs> Somebody had to be weird. <laughs> You're the one weird. And then it's because yeah. I was the firstborn, dude. They treated me like you, got you know. Spoiled. Like yeah, probably. Did. I don't know, but we didn't really have money back, so I don't really understand. Maybe just I got spoiled with love. Mm. Maybe I got spoiled with love, and that's the most important Very sweet. gift. Very loved it. <laughs> Mark, yep. your your Christmases were lit. Mark grew up rough too. Ah, Mark I burned mean, a house down. Try, you can tell. Yeah, yeah, we try. You try. But you know, I always would, I remember being jealous of like neighbors who would make a big elaborate show ahead of time and be like, "Look at our tree. We have like so yeah. many gifts in there." Like my parents weren't about like that, but they definitely tried. And, you know. Do you remember the one toy? I I remember there's one toy I wanted so bad I would cry at night because mm. I thought Santa was delivering this bullshit. I tell my son, I'm like, "Daddy bought this from telling dick jokes." Mm -hmm. Santa didn't drop that up. Daddy had to perform in San Antonio a little bit, <laughs> right? But um, the toy I wanted so bad as a kid was uh, Teddy Rupskin. Yeah, you said it wrong, but yeah, uh, that. What do, you, how do you, what do you call it? Teddy Ruxpin. Ruxpin. Yeah. Oh, there you go. I mean, it's a bullshit made up thing, but that that's creepy as fuck. You wanted that. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> I'm Teddy Ruxpin. No, it's lit. You could put a cassette in his back and he'd like tell you a story. Here's the problem with that. You, well, I'm rough on toys. His jaw fell off. That thing was terrifying. <laughs> terrifying. Yeah, that thing was fucking killer. They Massive. made money on that the, shit. The only thing bigger than that was. Um, Remember my pet Elmo? I was uh -huh. in high school, but I that remember was a little people were getting stabbed. For tickle it. me Elmo. Really? Tickle me Elmo. My pet Elmo, yeah. Dude, that's crazy, bro. <laughs> oh, it's my pet monster. My pet monster, tickle me Elmo. Hey, hey you're a word Nazi, huh? Not with you. Hey, are you are you are you my English teacher from it's high school, Miss Deacon? Yeah. But I wasn't even trying to correct are, you. I was trying to figure out. Tits. I know, I know, I know, I know. I, I wasn't trying to correct you. I was trying to figure out. No, you out should what though. No, no, I I was with Teddy Ruxpin. What's this? Oh, that was the WWF ring, that's and that, I had the oh, figures too. I had that. I had Macho Man, Ultimate Warrior, mm -hmm. Hulk Hogan. Mm -hmm. Awesome. I'm trying because yeah, we can't say me. It was like I'm trying to think what else was big. Cars was big. I loved model. Transformers. Um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles was my big Lit, one. Me too. Big, big one, yeah. I had the blimp. Oh, so did I. I had, the blimp. I had all the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. He-Mans. I had a lot of He-Mans. Did what? you fuck with He-Man? <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I had so many He-Mans. I still have them. The He-Man movie was on the other night when it was on the with road. Dolph Lundgren? Oh, it was good. Really? Wow. He-Man was gay, huh? Yeah, his <laughs> outfit no was way super in gay. hell He-Man was not gay, right? No, look at that outfit. Look at him when he's Prince Adam or whatever. Look at I his mean, look at his dragon. But look at his pink with, with the pink and the fucking click on the on the left there. Look at how gay, dude. And it's fine, but he is. Yeah, that's in the 80s, right? too. No, he ain't gay, man. I mean, dude. He? I couldn't figure man? the movie out. I couldn't so, figure the movie out. trying to cover it. It was it was 2 in the morning. I was, yeah. I was watching it. I'm like, God, man, this looks cool. I'm like, where did I know this from? And then it, I, I realized when Dolph Lundgren popped up, I was like, oh, this is, when I was a kid, this you, was my you, shit. Yeah, you didn't even know that it was He-Man until you saw Dolph Lundgren. Yes, right. I had yeah, no yeah, idea. Yeah, yeah. I was like, where's this from? It had the guy with the yep, white mask. Yep. I'm like, what is that from? Dolph Lundgren works out at my gym, or you, the gym I used to go to. I used to see him sometimes. You know, he's a, he was like a legit scientist, like Russian scientist. What? Right? Yeah, super wicked smart. What? Stupid smart. That's, that must be why he wouldn't shut up about biology when we were working out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I know another thing about biology, dude. I don't. I don't care, man. What? I don't fucking give a shit. All right. Tell me uh, what gear you're running, Dolph. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, dude, I I can't wait to get on gear when I'm 60, bro. I'm gonna be on so much. Are you gonna gear. do it then? Yes. That's and my buddy Dylan was He Man this cool. Halloween. There you go. And this to, goes killed to prove that. Yeah, that's a he -Man's very gay. gay. <laughs> is that is that a woman uh, under the Skeletor one? Yeah, that's his wife. She had a miserable time with that mask on. Yeah, oh, the worst. Hot. That's the thing. You put a mask on, you're like, fuck yeah, and then. 30 minutes in, you're like, this was a big mistake. I'm fucking sweats pouring out of my brow. Those masks are beast. Um, all right, let's see what's up with the golden hour, guys. Let's see what the submissions we got. If you have a submission, hit what? What, Nick? Uh, the golden hour subs at gmail.com. There you go. And shout you out to everyone who sent them in lately because mm -hmm. they are popping. Yep, yep. And we are trying to. Look, we appreciate. We see the guy here with the Carhartt uh, beanie on. We know when this show was Cats, even though it's a completely different show now. Um, that Carhartt played a big part. We're, they were a sponsor. Here, and, sponsor. And we appreciate all the fans. We're trying to weed out the Carhartt fans, man. <laughs> <laughs> all right? Just, just, just let you know, we got to weed out the fucking Carhartt fans. Diversify okay? a little That's about 50% of our fan base. But uh, yeah, man, <laughs> no, we appreciate you. All right, let's do it. What's going on, Golden Hour crew? Fellow Patreon member here. I don't know how your segments work these days, but I figured Neither I'd do just we. send in a video and see what's up. What do you guys think? You into hiking? We're not. On the snow. Brennan, I know your thick ass gets up a mountain here and there. Yep. Thick Boy Nation, Bike Club, Chris. 
I don't know if those peg legs can get you up a foothill or okay. not. It's disrespectful. Eric, but... <laughs> you got to not wear jeans if you're trying to hike. Okay. Thanks. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Chris, I'll see you in Boise May 19th. Hook a brother up with some VIP tickets. They already sold out, right? Lifetime member, longtime listener, big fan of all you guys. The show's doing great so far. You guys, nice as shit. I don't know shit. what else to say, but... You said it all, my baby. Look at this beautiful wow, view. Wow, it's beautiful. Uh, Look at know, that. Let me know, boys. Freezing. Take care. Boise, Boise, Idaho, dude. I'll be there Have Boise. you been there before? May, yeah. One, one or two times. Yeah. Great, man. Yeah. I mean, great. Place. I was like the Egyptian, I think. Did you play that? No, I forget what theater I played. But now I'm doing though. some kind of, I don't know what I'm doing. Not not that. Some of the best crowds, man. Yeah, yeah Boise's great. I love it. Boise. Also, Boise's a cool town. It's so like coming up and shit. It's like. They don't like that now. They don't like what? No, but boys doesn't like Californians moving there. Oh, oh, I didn't know Californians were moving there. Oh, yeah. Well, I know Aaron Paul, my buddy Aaron Paul moved there. Well, he's from there, though, so that, that doesn't count. That doesn't count. Yeah. But he... Um, yeah. Uh, his thing was uh, King or Sting It Hiking? No, no, no. It, no, no yes. No. He just said hiking. Sour, 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 right? sour, 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 sour Power. Sour Power. Sour so Power. Sour Power. Sour Power. Here's the deal, dude. I like hiking, okay? I do like hiking. And there's a YouTube video of me going hiking, and it fucking did dummy numbers, and everyone likes to see me hiking, and it's fine, dude. And I did that, and are I like hiking. Are you going to continue to do it? You can't say you, you go hiking if you've only been once. Oh, no. I used to go hiking a, a bunch, but then I stopped because... Um, Life. Kids. Yeah, just kind of life and stuff. But, uh, you know, I like hiking. Getting outside is good, man. I'm white as fuck, dude. And, like, to get that fresh air feels really good. You Nothing know? better. Yeah. I used to take my son hiking with me all the time. That's and cool. then we saw a bunch of rattlesnakes. I'm like, no more, buddy. No oh, more. Jesus no Christ. more. So then I go by myself. I still go all the time. Probably twice a week. Yeah, you go a lot, huh? All the time. Yeah, I love it. What times do you go in the day? Early. I only work out early. If I don't work out early, it ain't getting done. All right. So when do you wake up? 5.30. It's too early. So when do you, uh, when do you go to sleep? I'm in bed by nine. Come I'm on, doing, bro. Unless I'm doing sets. Nine, dude? I'm watching a show in there. Yay, dude. <laughs> okay. Nine, and you're watching a show, and then you're out by what? 10.30. Yay, dude. All right, <laughs> that's fine. And you go to bed at what? Like one every night, no matter what? Yeah. How's that skin? Oh, it's terrible. Oh, no, dude, I sleep. And you wake up at what time? Ten. Solid nine hours. Dude. He but figured you, it out. But you don't wake up with the kiddo ever. He wakes up at fucking 10, dude. That's insane. He's got comic that hours. That is your kid. Bro, it's that the shit, That is your fucking man. kid. I wake up and Kristen is right there and shit. And we're just chilling. And we're like, what should we do? We look on the Nanit. Calvin's just still like, he's like, <laughs> out, you know? And then, um, and then. Uh, re look, research, research indicates that an hour of natural light in the morning will help you sleep better. Mm -hmm. What? Regulates your oh, so you rhythm. go outside. Yeah, right. You're supposed to right when you wake up, go outside, outside. Let That's your feet touch touch the ground. Really? Some grounding. Yep, ground yourself. Grounding is that what it's called? Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is this called something? Mm -hmm. uh, just putting your feet on grass, like as soon as you grass. get out, sun, boom. I'm up at five thirty. My my kid is up at five. All right, so you wake up at five thirty. Yep. You go hiking, or, or or what's a day? You wake up five thirty, and then what? Go down so You drink it's just nine me in Boston. I drink four. Uh, shots of espresso. Okay. I'll drink a Diet Dr. Pepper. Come on. Yep. And then I'll watch uh, YouTube music videos with the kiddo. Mm -hmm. Then I'll get them ready for school. They leave for school. Daddy's At hiking. what time? we got to do the Probably time. Probably eight -ish. Okay. And then you go hiking. No, I'm hiking. Okay. So that's cool. It's not too early to hike. No. Why? We have a 530, huh? Yeah. And, and it, early bird gets can the you, worm. Yeah. Can you, and can you sleep past that or no? You wake up no, at 530. No, Even though wow. I'm on the road, that's why, it, that's why on the road it might. You're fucked. Super, because if I go to bed at one, don't matter. Mm, Daddy waking up at mm. five thirty-six Pacific waking time, up, no matter what. Whoa, waking up on the road in the morning is so awesome, though, because you get to look at the city and shit and walk around. You know what I mean? Yeah. If, you, if you're in a cool city. If you're in a cool city. But yeah, especially if you're really early. Fort Wayne, Indiana, and it's not so fun, oh, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You don't want to wake up. You want to sleep. You're like, please, I want to <laughs> sleep God, more. Just let me sleep. Till I have to hit the stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but like, I, we went, we went to Boston, and it was fucking, it was lit. We got to walk around. No, Boston's fucking great. I could live in Boston. Boston. They didn't have winners. They didn't have winners. I know. I know, bro. Daddy, can't I can't do, do it, dude. Can't do it. I can't do it. Not built for winners. Nah, not built for winners, dude. You're from Denver, though. I know. That's why I moved. I know, exactly, dude. I'm from New Jersey, dude. I'm from the dirty jurors, bro. Jersey jurors. And, 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 dude, I trust me, man. Dirty jurors for me, man. Dirty jurors. All right, cool. Who, what's this guy want? All right. Got a question for y'all. Maybe, uh, maybe a new segment if somebody has a similar story or something, but... Uh, simp or pimp? I was talking to this girl for a little bit, and she was in a new city, no friends or family, and but she ha she was moving from her apartment to her new house and didn't have any help. So I drove seven hours to help her uh, move, basically. 
Um, I didn't get laid. I don't know if that's a determining factor or not, but um, yeah, is that a simp or pimp? You know, is that a nice thing to do for somebody or is that just a little too far? Let me know. Love you guys. Well, the only reason you decided to do it is because she's hot. Well, would you do it for a guy? Absolutely not. There you go. Real friends don't ask friends to help them move or drive them to the Did he end up laying horizontal with her? Nope. No, not no. So simp. That's it. I agree, simp. Because if she wasn't banging, you would never drive seven hours. True. If you got it wet, pimp. You kept it dry, simp. Yep. It's very simp. (laughs) Wet or dry. (laughs) Dude. Wet or dry. You you helped her put her bed in the room and then, all right, well, (laughs) I mean, dude. Nothing. Sam! <laughs> Dude, now how long do you help her move? And then it's getting late. And she's like, all right, well, I guess I'm just going to go hang out with my friends. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to hit the road for seven hours, bitch. She's oh, my all, God. How fun. I drove 14 hours. Unless it was three and a half each way. I, we don't know. Either way. Either way, too long. Dude. Too long. Don't, don't, yeah. Well, also, read the room. Here's the other thing, too. I don't like nice guys that are trying to get some shit. If you're a nice guy, be a nice guy. I got a buddy, David Sullivan. You know him. I brought him up before on this podcast yes. and always on my podcast. Congratulations. Go subscribe to Super Cult Studios. But he is just a legit nice guy. A legit nice guy. Like he would help you out. If he is no in an elevator, attached. if there is a woman there and he likes the woman's watch, it, dep- it does not matter if she's a 10 or a 1. He'll say, oh, that was a really nice watch. My point is, if she's a 10... He's not hitting on her. He is not hitting on her. Well, He's the point just is he paying likes her a watches. No, no, no. He does. I'm just. I'm giving an example. <laughs> no, I right? get it. But, but he is just a nice guy. He's never trying to get anything from it, and that's beautiful. But if you're a dude that helps somebody move to try and get horizontal with the lady, that's a little bit fucking cagey, little right? Shady. Because little shady. You got to be up front. You got to be up front. I think I feel like you got to be front. Women always say, "I like a guy who's upfront and honest." You know, they lie, but still. <laughs> but if he if he would have shown a picture like I drove seven hours and it was like you know mm-hmm. bit of a warlock, mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, he's a good dude. Yeah. I guarantee you, she had some sweater puppies on her right now. Mm. Well, he's a good that looking. He dude. didn't get to see. Well, maybe honestly, he could have. He could have probably. Maybe she wanted to. If this guy's asking, my point is this: this guy's good looking. Okay. If this guy is asking this question to us, then he is insecure enough to also fail at closing the deal after he helps put the bed in the room. He First figured it out, dude. And that's why I'm fucking here, dude. Yes. That's the only reason you're here. Dude, this guy. Nice guy, though. He fucked up. Nice guy, but also Sim. a little bit cagey, but also didn't close the deal. He needs to. He's he, in the middle. Yeah. You, bro, realize who you are. He's standing there. He's got all the fucking infinity stones. You're sweating. Dude, he's driving all over creation. Now You're sweating. Move. He found the fucking orange one. He found the green one. He found the blue one. He's just holding them, holding them in his hand. Doing Put nothing. Put them in the knuckles, baby. Put them in the knuckles. Get your dick wet. <laughs> guy got all the stones. He doesn't know where they go. This fucking guy. He said, I drove seven hours. I put an Ikea couch together. It took me another four hours. Guys, God. She said, thanks. And yeah, it's just went in the room with another dude. Dude, this guy. And you know, ugly, <laughs> <laughs> ugly guys are watching this shit like, this guy doesn't know he has it all. <laughs> <laughs> fucking guy, bro. So send in your simp that guy or doesn't pimps. know his word. S- yeah, send in your simp That's a or good pimp. Simp or pimp is yeah. great. Situations that you put yourself Because right now you're there. a simp, but here's the good news, dude. You could be a pimp. <laughs> you have the looks for a pimp, <sighs> but you have the attitude of a simp. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's see what's up with this dude. Yo, what's going on, guys? Uh, thanks for having me. Zach this, from this guy has here. six different so, accesses. I've sent you a little attachment. Is he a radio uh, host? A nice little family video that I like to send to one of my close friends. You know, in this example, it's me asking him if uh, he wants to play some Call of Duty. Uh, just a nice little family video that, you Is know, you got that one friend that you're close with. KBPI. So, uh, that brings me to my question. Do any of y'all have that one really close friend that you're comfortable sending weird videos to, you know? And if you do have that one friend, maybe you could share with us, like, who it is and what kind of vid you send. Oh. All right, our power, flip it. Dude, this oh, guy. Oh, Callan sh- sent me a dick pic once This a guy week. is literally has six different accents. I don't understand. He's a radio host. All right. So, he has and to be a radio this is the host. video he sent to his friend? Yeah. Okay. Hey, you sexy bastard. I just got out of the shower and I use the old flashlight. Oh. Uh-huh. I like the mustache, man. Oh. I'm playing. I'm doing. I'm doing helicopters right now, and you can't even see it. You hear that? Listen. Oh. Let's get oh. these dubs. Twenty minutes. Hey dude. <laughs> hey dude. You're. Hey. You're in a relationship <laughs> with that guy. <laughs> but also, well, I'd play Call of Duty with him. That's a quality <laughs> video. Yeah, but but guy, what the fuck, man? That's I wild would be like shit. Uh, 
<laughs> the, I, I don't have any friends send stuff. We'll send stupid I've stuff. I've sent the funny stuff when you, the, you know, obviously yeah. it's humor amongst us yeah, where yeah. we're bragging about something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We're like, oh, so annoying, Chris. You right. you relate to this with the fries, yeah, yeah. And we're but we sent to Brian because he's yeah. Prius. You know, yeah. there's funny with that. I send uh, I sent a uh, picture, uh, um, my sheets over my. This was fucking 15 years ago. I sent my sheets over my boner and <laughs> sent it to Callan, and I said, "Holy shit, there's a ghost in you my." You sent bedroom. to both of us. Oh you, yeah, yeah, really? Yeah, yeah. I said, "Holy shit, there's a yeah, ghost in my bedroom." Yeah. It's haunted. Ah! <laughs> so that. But this shit is like, this is like the fucking, the, the, the Ace Ventura, the porn star. The way he's Do doing Do you it. have to slap your nuts against your leg? No, I think that's his penis, right? Yeah, helicopter. Smashing it around. Oh. <laughs> I'm, playing, I'm, doing, I'm doing helicopters right now and you can't even see it. I mean, Get four years it. old. What do you say? So 20 minutes? Free call of duty. See you on there in 20 oh. minutes. T minus 20 minutes. God, this guy's a wacko, huh? <laughs> All right, let's get these dubs. What does that mean? Yeah, I mean, the wins. Really, oh, really only wow, you so. and Brian send me funny videos. Mm. But then now it's like as you get older, friends send serious videos. Mm -hmm. Like, hey, man, just out here in whatever, New York, think yep. about that. I'm like, oh, no, this is mm -hmm. sad. Mm hmm. Remember that time, man? There's the three of us. I'm like, you, okay. Our friend died. <laughs> um, that yeah. That got hit by that car. That's, uh, yeah, I don't know, man. That's, uh, you got to change. That guy's got to change, huh? <laughs> <laughs> or he's a good time. <laughs> yeah, no, he seems like fucking fun. When uh, Aljo was on Food Truck Diaries, I, I was in the stall next to him, and I sent a video of people. I was, I was like, I'm pooping next to the champ. Oh, that's right. Oh you, you sent me a video taking shit. He was cool with that. You know who sends, or used to, I don't know if he still does, he's a little more mature now. You know who sends the most horrible shit at just is Will Sasso. Oh, really? He would send a dude just fist another dude's ass, that's pulling his disgusting. anus out. Yeah, like, no, not to me. I, I, I had to Gross. block him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Gross. <laughs> Mike, Mike Catherine like would that. do that too, but like, Mike, dude, check yeah, out this yeah, yeah. wiener. I'm like, Mike dude, has a, uh, very I'm on a flight, bro. Twisted sense of humor. Love that dude. Um, Catherine, oh. one of the best people. He moved to Austin. I know. He's like a farm out there. I know. Send me a video. He's like, DJ, have these chickens. I know. Like, I know. <laughs> Gonna eat them. You like eggs? Yeah. All right, let's see what's up. <laughs> hey, what's up, you guys? Love the show. Friendly as um, shit. You're yeah. all awesome. Thank you. My name's Sydney. I'm from British Columbia. Great. And my question uh, is Jack. traveling with children. So I'm supposed to be going to Maui in January. Ah, uh, nice. Um, and my little one's going to be four months old. That's it. Oh. And oh. I don't want to be the person on the plane with the oh, screaming baby. So she just had no the kid. one likes being on a plane with a screaming baby. Uh, parents understand, though. But I also want to go to Maui. Uh, so let me know your thoughts. Traveling with children. I need more cool, details. Not cool. Get it done. Teach Hold them on. early. What are your thoughts? But hold on, though. Thank she. You. She just had the kids. Yeah, she just had the kids. She doesn't look four months. I mean, I no, guess you can't she, see her belly, but yeah, no, she looks great though. Yeah, it looks. But great. I need more details. If you're gonna travel with the kiddo. A, you'll be surprised. Like I know there's always those terrible kids on the plane. Most kids are chill. Like my kid yeah. has always been chill. Mine the, too. Yeah, he's just glad to be there. Mm -hmm. He shuts the fuck up. Me too. I'm chill. I used to cry all the time on planes. But yeah, I'm chill now too. I yeah, really a few years ago, I just be like, nah! yeah, <laughs> sir. And then also, you <laughs> sir, can you <laughs> shut the fuck up? <laughs> But then also, if you're going to Maui, is it is she a single mother? Is it is there a husband? Is the grandma going to help mm, you so you mm, get some free time mm. with your man? Otherwise, yeah. stay kid to San Diego. Yeah, yeah, true. They don't fucking well, know. Or whatever the San Diego is version of British Columbia. But you, you, yeah, that is a good point. If you're going on a trip with just your kid, your former month old, you're not gonna have fun in in Maui. You got, hopefully you're going with your hus husband or, or guy or whatever. Yeah, four or, months, they go to bed at like six. I, I know you're not going to be able to do. Uh, but so do, do you anyway. So, but you can't. You can't. You gotta um, bring someone else too. Don't not just the kid. But uh, the, you know what? The, this is rich guy talking though, isn't it? Well, no, a little bit in it. No, those. no, because I just wouldn't go if I didn't have the money. I, I just wouldn't go if it was just me and my kid. I wouldn't go. Why would I go to Maui? That's what I'm saying. That's, that's, that's a long ass flight. So, but, but also to bring a nanny or like... No, you don't bring a nanny. I'm saying if you have your husband and you're going with your husband... No, even your husband because you're both locked out. So is your I husband so. like, yeah. have fun with the kid. I'm going out getting no, some my time. No, I guess not. Yeah, you could take you could take turns. But, but if, you, if you have grandma there, I'm like, hey, right. Good point. hey, old bitch, you've Good seen point. everything. Stay with the you've kid. You've seen everything. But the but hold on, though. Her question was on the flight. If, if, if you have... You'll be the, surprised. 
What about what? Like everyone assumes kids are gonna do bad. My kids were never bad, but also I'll tell you, I, I fly all the time. Mm -hmm. If there's a kid crying, I see the mom just like, oh man, and people get mad. I will, I will fight somebody for that. I'm like, you have no yeah. fucking clue. She's already stressed I know, out. I know. Like I you agree. turn around, going, can, can you do something I about agree. the kid? I agree. Yeah, bitch, they're trying to. I agree. I think that you bring the kid. That's just part of flying. Sometimes there's a baby crying. Okay, so it, there's a baby crying. Well, so this mom doesn't get to go fucking enjoy Maui because yep. of that. You know that's annoying as fuck. Also, anyone who's like, "Can you quiet the kid?" Uh, no, <laughs> no. It's, I'm gonna do what it does. It's so fucking annoying. Baby's gonna baby. It's man. like when someone b knocks on the door when you're in the in the urinal at the fucking coffee bean and tea leaf, and you're like, "You think I'm in this disgusting bathroom any longer Hanging than out? I want to be?" Hanging uh, trust out. Trust me, I want to get out of this place that smells like only shit <laughs> as quick as possible. Yes. yes. One time in the knock, 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 knock. I, I opened the door. I said, You think I'm having a party in there? I said to the lady, <laughs> yeah. I was so pissed off. And she says, I don't know. Well, it seemed like it. No. Oh. I was like, Trust. I said, Trust me, I want to get out of here ASAP. But that is work to do. I had fucking I'm, I'm work to I'm do. I'm loaded up on coffee. Feet up. And it's about to be a mudslide. <laughs> Feet up. You should have closed the door and played Ranchero music. What's have, that? Just have a party in there. <laughs> <laughs> One more time, got me feeling so free. <laughs> We're gonna <laughs> celebrate. <laughs> to celebrate and dance with me. <laughs> <laughs> One more time. Oh. <laughs> 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 Celebrate. I'm kidding. You could do it. I'm, I'm Celebrate. Gonna... No, I didn't know the rest of the words. Usually, <laughs> I, usually I will chime try, try in, though. <laughs> I live. I won't green. I won't die. And I lead. Oh, what blue. happened to them? That's that part, I'm right? blue. Gotta be on a body. That punk's the shit, be, dude. Gotta be on Gotta be on a guy. Ah, oh, I hurt my jaw. Great. Ah, fuck. The blue man group. And those, and those are different than the guys doing the no, that's magic the in Vegas. That's not the blue no. man group. Yeah. Huh? No, that, blue and now I'm blue. I'm blue, that's gotta Punk. be, gotta be, gotta be. Blue, gotta yeah. the yeah. blue, blue by Daft Punk. And now, now the, do they still do the magic shit? They're old as fuck. Those, they have the life because they're not famous. They're right. blue. Oh, right? Eiffel 65. Oh, that's right. Oh, but it was a song called Blue. Blue, yeah. And they sound like Daft Punk. Um, they look blue, like them too. Got, the Daft Punk guys are brilliant too. Daba D in parentheses. <laughs> da ba da be da da be. Um, you can say whatever you want, though, right? Um, yeah. Daft Punk's brilliant because no, they that. knew they were gonna be huge, and they go, "We're gonna wear helmets, so we don't get, we can still walk the streets. Nobody knows us." Brilliant. Daft Punk, yeah, yeah, that's great. That's great. That's awesome. I'm gonna do it with my comedy. Wear a helmet. It's wear too a helmet. late, though. Yeah. Too late. It is. You but 60, I'll get facial. Sixty thousand tickets in Boston. I'll get facial reconstructive surgery. Not sixty thousand. That would be. I would be the Blackhawks. Okay. Uh, it's six thousand one hundred. And I'm going to get well, facial. Be the Boston Bruins. I'm going to get facial reconstructive surgery. Then I start putting on a helmet on so nobody knows who I am. And then I take the helmet off. Like, <laughs> like, or you're just a regular guy. What's this young man want? Hey, just to ask you, have you guys seen my gla uh, my sunglasses? <laughs> <laughs> you're at Faber's chin. What's up, my babies? Uh, it's your boy, Tim. Nice. Uh, I got a debate club for you guys. Uh, so personally, I hate these two groups of people equally. Blacks and um, Asians. It's the people that <laughs> well, like, saturate their lawns with political signs, politicians. Oh, yeah. That's oh, like, nothing worse. Make a dent. Yeah, are you trying or to get the egg? people who put their bumper stickers, bumper stickers. all over the fucking car. Annoying. Um, with their beliefs of the world yes um, like anyone gives a shit i know unless it's so, a trump uh, sticker, you guys can what are debate that i hate them both just kidding um i'm sure you do too i uh, love the show love you guys Mwah. nice i the, like that guy uh, a lot. when you when you see a subaru outback uh -huh. and it has a hillary clinton 20 whatever it is 16 mm -hmm. sticker on mm -hmm. it it's disgusting okay what are you doing okay all of it is disgusting doesn't matter who you align yourself with. No, I'm, all of it's bad. But if, if she lost, and you, you oh, know, you know oh, you're can, saying you know now, you can, yeah, now you're saying you, know you can take now. it off, oh, right? Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah, 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 that's ridiculous. It's insane. It's, uh, it's like having a Buffalo Bill sticker on your car. Like they should have won. Yeah, or know? being like, like Jimmy Carter, eight, 19, yeah. eight. It's like, dude, I've even seen bumper stickers. Listen, I was just in Texas. Said Trump was robbed. Still? Oh, yeah, oh, I was just there. Yeah. My my whole thing is just get over it. Whatever happened, just get over it. If, if Trump runs again, then put the Trump bumper sticker back on. 
But like, just get over it. We get the new bumper sticker. It's because also a bumper sticker. Right. Just put it over the old one. Right, 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 right. We should write a bumper sticker and sell it as merch. God, that's planets a brilliant are idea. Hard to f- Good planet. Wow, I read it wrong. Compost happens. Jesus Christ, that's so stupid. Remember who you wanted to be. Don't get even. Get odd. Wow, this is the. This is like school teacher central. <laughs> Hunty Dumpty was pushed. Wow, this is a conspiracy person. Eve was framed. It you says. may already be doomed. Only as a, a life. Wow, that's rip. the best one. Then my he has com- a life rip sticker. That's cool. My favorite. <laughs> the favorite one is my comedy channel, Fox News. My news source, Comedy Central. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, how old are these? Jesus Dude, Christ. Dude, corporate media. The rich telling the middle class to blame the poor. Ooh, isn't that true? That one, see, that one speaks to me, dude. <laughs> oh, wow, this is amazing. This is, these are amazing. These fucking suck. It is weird people <laughs> that get their news from CNN or Fox. It's all wrong. Dude. It's all. Dude, they, they saw the fucking, you saw the shit, what they were saying about the Dave Chappelle. Like, they were, CNN was trying to say, like, he was being hateful towards Jews. They said he was promoting anti Bro, he wasn't. Stuff. Did you see his bit? Yeah. His monologue was fantastic. It was great. Crushed But, but, but you whether know, or changed, not. This is what Savage, I hate to interrupt you. This is what Savage. So in the you don't have to do rehearsals. Mm-hmm. He did a safe one during the rehearsal. Completely changed it when it went live. Gangster. That is gangster. Because he knew they would be like, no, you can't do this. This. He's like, cool. But it wasn't even hateful. It was fantastic. But 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 whether or not you think it's fantastic, you how can you see that and well, think no, I'm he's saying perpetuating if, hate? Oops, right. But if it was hateful, <laughs> I'm just trying to clear you up. But if, if it was hateful, I wouldn't say it's fantastic. It's fantastic because oh. it's not. Right. It's fantastic because it's take on Kanye and Kyrie Irving mm-hmm. and Herschel Walker. Mm-hmm. It was brilliant. Dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But it's not promoting anti Semitic shit. No. It's a good thing. No, he even said Kanye. I mean, it was the opposite. Yes. Wasn't it? Am I, am I missing something? Did you guys see it? I did. He was basically Anything? trying to say, like, I, like, when you fucked up. Like, first thing I learned when I got to LA is you don't fuck with yeah. Jews. And the Jews are saying that's the problem. You guys saying we run Hollywood, we run oh, banks is oh, the problem. Oh, oh, He's oh. Human. That's what they were saying? Yeah, because they're like, you keep pushing this narrative. But why That's is that true. even bad to be running Hollywood? I want to run Hollywood, dude. Why is it bad to say? That's like being like, yo, they're, they're good at fucking, you know. Yeah, but when anything happens, they're like, well, the Jews run it. or You know what I'm saying? So it's like, it's like the same thing with how people are like, uh, you know, if it's a black athlete, they're like, oh, he's really athletic. All right. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It's good stuff. It's like that yeah. narrative. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, it's like, well, That's no. what they're saying. Yeah. Huh. What's that say there? The, if they're black, then it's a gang. If they're Italian, it's a mob. But if they're Jewish, it's a coincidence, and you should never speak about it. They're not saying that that's bad, right? Uh, uh, I think, so. I mean. What? I, Dave I, I, also, it's a joke. But Dave, yeah. A, it's a joke, but Dave also said one of the things that was told to me, that's not him that's that yeah. wasn't his original idea. He's right. saying one of the things when I got to LA, boom, boom, boom. Yeah, you know, probably didn't happen. Then he's just making it up, and it's a joke. But yes, either way, it's, it's a joke. It's yeah, also it's, Dave Chappelle. He, it's I also thought funny. it was fantastic. Yeah, it was great. It was great. It was great. It was fucking great. Period. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what they want. They just want. I don't. Well, know they're what they never want. gonna be happy. No, I, the woke will never be happy. The woke will never be happy. Uh, people were pissed off when I did the. And remember, I told you. Uh, what were we calling it? Uh, piss on it or? Pee on it? What's, what's our new thing? Pit? Shower of like, power? Shower of power. Yeah. Remember, I was like, Jeffrey Dahmer for Milwaukee mm-hmm. promo. Remember mm-hmm. I did that? Yeah. Some people were furious. Because you did that promo? Yeah. What, furious. Like, how so? Just like, I can't believe you're capitalizing. This is marketing. Really? Like, sold out. Wow. You've been doing parody posters for 10 years. Forever. It, Forever. It's insane. And Dahmer's so hot right now with that Netflix thing. He's from Milwaukee. Figure it out. Did they yeah. get mad at Netflix? I know you, yeah, I, I get know. mad at Netflix. They're doing. By the way, they're doing a bunch of different ones now. They're doing the fucking John Wayne Gacy. They're doing. They're doing the. the they're doing more. Yeah, yeah. I'm. The, I'm all for it. Yeah, and they all got then victims. Richard and Ramirez, shit. Charles yeah, Manson. Doing, keep yeah. going. Get Obviously, it. there's a demo for it. It's like oh, the yeah. most watched show. You know what? Beat Squid Games. Stranger Things. Yeah. Beat Squid Games. Mm. Wow. Nutsos. All right. That's Jin's shirt. Yep, it is. Oh, sorry, just a little flex. Um, <laughs> basically, do I believe in aliens? Is this guy a nut job? What's the deal? You know, it's hard to say. When you think of how big he was confused the by the assignment, is, how little we are, mm-hmm. Earth. Mm-hmm. It's almost naive to think that there isn't something else out there. I don't know if they're coming to get us. Might not hurt to. Uh, 
be prepared. What's that? Here we go. And, and that's when you cross yeah. over to crazy. Stay yep. ready. You don't hey, got to get ready. Stay ready for what? Yeah. They might come over and. <laughs> what are you going to do? I, stay ready with guns. I'd like to hear what you have to say. I I I, I think it, it's you know it's pretty naive to think that we're the only things here in there. Oh, can't the either, Dan. But it's naive um, to. Th- what else I don't like is they think it's gonna be like Mars Attack. We're like, da, 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 yeah, you don't know what they're gonna do. Up. They might be really cool. Yeah. They might come down like, oh, you guys are morons. We're good and just dip out. Yeah. Yeah. We might be that. You know. Or they might be dumber than us. Who we knows? might be a yellow starburst to them. We're like, oh, we're good. Right. They're terrible. Right. Okay. That Saturn is inhabited. It's inhabited by an army inside the planet Saturn. They're planning some kind of a military expedition. NASA believes that that expedition is going to be an invasion of the Earth. I've been told by agree one hundred percent. There's people inside Saturn, inside Saturn, and they're, pre- and they're, they're preparing, preparing to take over the a Earth. military invasion for Earth. That's so <laughs> egotistical, bro. Like, dude, th- th- why would they give a shit? I would just look at him and go, oh, cool. Prove it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, I don't now agree say, with now that. That's come from a guy that believes in ghosts. Look at this guy, Jordan Maxwell. And, Is he oh, also a human turkey? Well, he died this year. <sighs> An alien killed him. Yep, from from Saturn. He, right after that video, they fucking... Wow, is this a Mortal Technique posted that? Yeah, uh, he didn't post it, but he was one of the first comments. He's like, look this guy up, Jordan Maxwell. Wow, Mortal Technique is hilarious. <laughs> but, but also... With the alien stuff, like we just assume them to be hostile as fuck. What if they're really loving and cool? I think it's racism at its finest, dude. Me too. They dude. might be green fucking totally matter. nice. You don't know. Green yeah. Lives wow. We're assuming they're green. I know. Don't even. It's because Hollywood painted this picture where they're going to be super hostile. And who runs Mars Hollywood? Attacks. And who runs Hollywood? Oh, <laughs> my God. Aliens. He's going to say aliens. <laughs> I'm just saying we're we're expecting the best. It might be lit as fuck. Oh, cool! Like, oh, let's show. That's you. my whole thing about like, like you guys like pasta. We got this dish, and they're yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, you like big dicks on our planet? Small dick. <laughs> and you're like, oh, perfect. No, you no, go down. dude. <laughs> they go, oh no, your dick's too big, dude. Um, that's my whole thing with ghosts. It's like if there's ghosts, cool, but show it to me. And also, I'm not scared. I want to meet some ghosts and say what up. Like, I'm not scared. If I wake up in the middle of the night and there's a ghost there, I go like this. Yo, can we like have a fucking great conversation? What's been going on? That would be nice. A lot of people are like, ah, get away, get away. Don't get away. No. Lay down, I mean, unless chill. they're evil. But they're not. But why? That's my thing. They're not evil? all evil. You're right. Again, there's this weird, you know, assumption that all ghosts are mean. Some Because if them. I was a ghost, if you were a ghost, would you be evil? No, no, no. Neither would I, bro. No, no. I'd be nice as fuck. You'd be like, I get moved out of this house. This ghost keeps flicking my dick, telling me weird yeah, shit, yeah, 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 interrupting yeah. me. Yeah. And drinking my yeah, shit yeah, all the yeah. time. And he's leaving nicotine all around the house. Yeah. And there's shit streaks in Sunday. Yeah. Mine would be like, oops. <laughs> <laughs> I keep hearing oops. That's me. This yeah. guy, is, I've been, everyone sent me this, dude. Look at this guy. That's me after facial reconstructive surgery. Oh, this guy's an alien. I'm going <laughs> to. He's so scary. That's me. No, imagine him putting this together, going through the different masks that he's wearing. He is. Uh, he's a serial killer, but he doesn't have the brain. I put a off. guy on on my TikTok. I put this guy on my TikTok, TikTok, <laughs> and I said, "Dad." <laughs> <laughs> but it was a different video of the guy. If you go to my TikTok, dude, he was um, it, dancing. And it's really funny. That's his thing. I don't want to get de- demonetized so, because of the song. But. Dude, someone said Hunter Biden vibes. <laughs> <laughs> Hunter Biden's a wild boy. Here, wait. Yeah. Oh, no. I guess it's a strange bird, man. That guy? Yeah. There we go. We click it. I want to. You like uh, it. Right I there, there. Is he singing? Yeah, but it doesn't. This is the song Creep. Don't do special. Well, look at the way he's saying. Look at that. Watch it. Watch Are this, you watch starting this. a chainsaw? Oh, he's good, oh. though. He's good, though. Now he's wearing a free shirt he bought for buying that however many big That shirt is golds. fucking lit, dude. That's me. 100% That's me. That's what you're doing in the bathroom when people are not Videos I send Calvin on the road. <laughs> so good, dude. He's just you know, expressing shit. himself. I love guys like that. And is he, is he crushing it online? Is that what he's doing? I don't think he's, he is. <laughs> I've only seen that one, the Nine Inch Nails, that yeah. ruined that song for me. I don't so. think he's crushing it. He might. But he might be. I mean, you he know. Might, he might open up for me. But that would be cool. I would love to. Have him open up for you? Yeah, dude. No. 
I think no, actually. Hard pass. Yeah. What else you got, Nicholas? My jaw doesn't hurt anymore. Hurt for a while. Oh, this guy looks like a guy that would be in Scooby Doo. So let's let's see what this guy has to say. He's from William coming at you live from Oregon. Oh, who's good, bro? Dude, who's good? You're on it today. Come on, man. You're on it. Back me up. I just knew. We didn't know. We don't know. We have not. No, we we have no clue. Who's good, bro? Who's good? (laughs) I do it. I do it good, dude. I did it. I do it good. You know what? I'm sorry for bragging. It's call it good. Was it the haircut, the glasses, the it's whole vibe, the hips or mustache? Vibe. You got it. You got to rely on your intuition. Now, is sometimes. it Portland, Oregon, specifically? I don't know. I would say Portland if I had to pick. I mean, who knows? I don't know anything about Oregon, except for uh, that guy's submission in it. for whom do I look like? So we're gonna go with Mr. Peabody. So guess before he gives options. Okay, Mr. Um, Peabody, the cartoon. Bring it up. He looks like the dog, um, or the, he looks like the kid with the dog. Either way, he looks like both of them. All right. I don't know who that Great is. Great movie. Uh, Mr. Peabody. Either Philip Seymour Hoffman. Oh, that's pretty good. Uh, Eric Stoltz. Or... Oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That's funny. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Same person. One's a cartoon dog. Eric Stoltz. Philip Seymour Hoffman. Um, oh, well, you don't look like Eric Stoltz, though, right? A little bit. Uh, you know, I don't know. He's uh, redheaded, kind of. It looks like a little no, bit of red. He's blonde, right? All right, then Philip Seymour Hoffman. I mean, Eric Stoltz was a fucking stud. I'll tell you that much. Great actor. And the nicest dude. Oh, yeah? Yes. Yeah, that's, that's good. I guess they both have glasses. Yeah, I mean, well, I don't know what the fucking who's the guy look like. I would never think he looks like anyone. He's just asking. Uh, he looks like Peabody, dude. <laughs> okay, or Peabody. Cartoon. Those are the three. Go ahead. <laughs> I mean, that's <laughs> spot on. What's up, baby? That's good. What's up, baby? Ryan Gosling. No. Down syndrome, Chris D'Elia. What? Or David Spade. Oh, David Spade. Oh. oh. Montez a little more than the others. He said, "I love all three of you equally." Montez a little yeah, more than you. Okay. okay. I love. I love him. I love Montez as well. Um. I. I people th- tell him Harry, I look like me. He looks. Like no, me. no. He's no. trying to oh. be funny. Oh, okay. He looks like a hairy David Spade. If David Spade could grow a mustache and a yeah, David beard. Spade, David Spade. If he didn't get into entertainment, there he is. A little bit, yeah. Also, sounds a little like him too, which is part of it. Tiger King, um, yeah. David, so yeah, yeah, I buy funny. that. I love David. I buy that. There we go. Yeah, I guarantee it's David Spade. Those other ones, not a chance. Well, yeah, those are just here. the options. There was no answer, but I mean, sure everybody. I mean, spot on. It's a gift, dude. You know your gifts to real people? I think I was special. I want to be special. Wow, that's bad. Man, I need singing bad. lessons. Yeah. Just yeah. for podcasting. It's too late, though, right? <laughs> I don't think so. You're if 40? I have a private tutor come over, I'm like, why are you doing this? I'm like, just so I can sing better on the podcast. You're pod. 40, though, and you're going to be uh, you're 38, right? Yeah. Yeah, and you're going to be a good singer by when? Oh, no. No, I don't want it good. I just want to be able to, uh, you know. You want to be able to hang with the, the homies. Boys. <laughs> Because Eric uh, can sing. You took lessons as a kid. Yeah. <laughs> gay. But then. You know, I'm gay. No, you're not gay. Well, I am gay. My dad was like, how about you just play tackle football at four and get CT instead of singing? Wow. Yeah, it's dark. When did you start football? Uh, I tackle football at six years old. Oh, uh, wow. That's too Play tall is 24. How old's your dad? 63. Oh, he's young. Yeah. Wow. Jesus. You. you, you he had you when he was fucking young. Yeah, Jesus. 20s, yeah. Well, let's not do math, but yeah. yeah. Let's not do that. I don't know how to I do think math. I was 13. 23, wow. 23. I'm 42. Were your, were your parents, did they have you when you were older? They had me when I was older. They had me when they were like 30 something, 32. Yeah. That's better. I mean, I don't know. It depends. Young. Yeah, well, they were. When you're young, like yeah. imagine having a kid, like if you've seen 16 pregnant, when there's, when I was 16, mm-hmm. you couldn't give me a plant. No, I little know that. A, or a pet lizard. Yeah. A little alone a fucking baby. Yeah. Like when I watch those kids, I'm like, oh my God. You, they figure it yeah. out though. I mean, 16 is very young to have a kid. But if you're 25, it's kind of cool because you could be young with the kid and like do the stuff with them and like, you know. But I still feel active now. Like I can do this shit. I think times have changed though. Uh. We're like, it's, it's like an older dad's better. You have more experience. You've also started your career. Because if yeah. you're like 25 yeah, and you're struggling. trying to figure yourself yeah. out, struggling. Beast. It would have been tough to do the road so much. Uh, the road and, sets at night. But yeah, but like, because I would have had to do sets every single night. Correct. Um, I, I, and grind, and uh, I don't have to do that now. You know, I could be more choosy, and mm-hmm. and that's cool because I get to spend more time with Calvin. Yeah. Like Josh Wolf, I, he was young as fuck. Joey Diaz had to watch his kids and shit all the time. Mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah, 
Well, Joey Diaz is he has one kid, right? Now he has a little girl. Oh, what did he have? He had one before that? No. Oh, right. But that's he would what... watch Josh, Josh Wolf's oh, kids. Oh, that's what you're saying. Yeah, okay, he was yeah. the babysitter. Oh, gotcha. Wow. So this yeah. guy used AI to uh, generate image of what you three would look like, you, Eric, and... Oh, my. This is Brendan as a Hell's Angel. And and all they put in is like Brendan Schaub, Hell's Angels. That's you as Hell's Angel. Okay. So what, AI, what does this mean? Like that you put in a bunch of pictures? Yeah. Um, and then they make... They have all the pictures. You literally just oh, type it wow. and they pull shit from the internet and it tries to figure it out. But I'm, I'm... That's you? I think that's two of you. It, it just oh kind of combines what it finds. Okay. Dolly wow, is so one of the confused. I'm just, right. I've, I've tried to figure the single shot out in my mouth. Yeah, yeah, it's, Am I yelling? it's AI. It's not perfect yet. You know, we're but not you gotta get AI, AI. Just make the mouth more more visual. Yeah, type in mouth too. All right, so then what? Oh, oh my, that's hilarious, wow. bro. That is my fucking basically my headshot for undateable. That's what that was. Looks, oh well, that that's mine is way better than yours. <laughs> well, yours on the left. Yours on the left looks like sales fentanyl. Oh, oh no, mustache. Why don't they just use my regular face, Eric? Oh, that's hilarious. Oh, wow. Why does it have an extra leg? <laughs> <laughs> I feel oh, like dude, that's so funny. Wow, that's the worst. Look at that body. That's also the is... Big Lebowski. Oh, yeah, he that's looks like John the Big Goodman. Lebowski. Looks yeah. like John Goodman in there. Wow, but why does if it's why does it look different than he actually? That's Steven Seagal. That's Steven Seagal. <laughs> that's Steven Seagal. <laughs> that's Steven Seagal. Yeah, Did you think the same thing? Steven yeah. Seagal, 100%. I like Eric on the, the left. Wa- but look at the motorcycle, how it's two motorcycles. What the fuck? That's it weird. Sense. And the, the one on the left is like two of them stacked together. It's, un, it's unsettling, bro. Yeah. Man. It is unsettling. I'm uncomfortable. This looks like artwork you'd buy at Venice Beach. <laughs> but Just why is that unsettling, sense. though? It's because it's not natural. Yeah, but you look at Salvador Dali, it's not really unsettl- unsettling. Maybe because you know made by, made by AI. Uh, we could think of some. So Dolly is the big AI generator, okay. and like it's Salvador like taking. Dolly. Interesting. Uh, yeah, and uh, I don't know. You could type in anything. Like, really, uh, like chin fighter in the. Type type in Joe Rogan. No, do Joe yeah. Rogan. Joe Rogan, Rogan, Rogan Superman. Or, do Superman. Rogan, Rogan aliens. Man. I do Rogan aliens. Just do Superman. I already fucking said it. All right. How long does it take? Sometimes seven minutes. Or just like sometimes what? Well, they have to draw it, dude. Be cool. Sometimes it works right away. Sometimes it doesn't because it's like overloaded because so many people are trying to use it. And this is Dolly, the first one. They have Dolly two, which you have to be. Oh, on the like this for. thing's popping where they where it takes some time. The robots like give me time. Yeah, don't oh. rush me. They probably we'll try they it another already, day. I would think they'd already have Joe Rogan as Superman. Just use that. Joe one. Rogan aliens. Guarantee everyone's done. Too easy. Too easy. Right? It's mm-hmm. obviously. It's already there. We'll leave it loading and then we'll. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, what a weird thing, though. I know. Yeah, that's very weird. I want to not... Uh, I, I, that's unsettling to me. I don't you know like what's unsettling? unsettling? So my red... You mm-hmm. know, like, the internet we use? Mm-hmm. Like, general internet? That's 5% of the... I know. The rest, most of the internet is the dark the web. The dark web, yeah. 90-some percent is the dark web. Below the glacier. It gets dark, dude. I know, dude. You've seen that shit? No. Me neither. I don't even touch it. I want... I, want, I, I, I don't... They say most of it isn't, like... Awful, awful shit, but a lot of it is just like, you know, drugs, like trying to get like drugs and shit. Like to get a hitman on the dark web is really fucking hard. Really? That's what they said. Because I can get one of classifieds. 50 bucks. Yeah. yeah. Kill you right now. Wow. Yeah, dude. Well, inflation, too? Yeah. This is like the most succinct. Like she used it to create a cover for Cosmo, Karen X. To put herself on it? Cosmo. But this one would be different than every other cover before it because this one would be their first magazine cover generated by artificial intelligence. What would it look like? I started off by getting on a call with the Cosmo team to discuss the creative direction of the cover. We wanted to represent a powerful woman and we decided- Cosmo's like, just put your name in it. I got to work and I used Dolly to generate options. Thousands of options, but none of them felt quite right. This one, for example, was too Um. boxy. Can't really tell she's a woman. Okay, that's better, but let's get her walking towards us. Okay, Maybe just put some tits on. Don't love her pose. For cosmopolitan? Yeah. Confident. Each time I adjusted my prompt. I'm looking for more confident astronaut. It's it hilarious if at the end it's just right some image. chick in a bikini. <laughs> there, perfect. The helmet, she's on their power. Hundreds of prompts. I finally figured out the right one. Guarantee it looks it like Halo. A wide angle shot from below 
of a female astronaut with an athletic feminine body oh, walking with swagger all bodies towards matter. camera on Mars in an infinite universe. This is what synthwave digital art. Jesus. And drumroll, here's how it turned out. Whoa. That's pretty lit cover. That could it's be cool. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah, Chin and I are fucked. They're taking their jobs. <laughs> yeah, but that could be a guy. Yeah, that's what I said. It doesn't look that awesome. I mean, could, but can I... Yeah. Have the tits fall yeah, out. I mean, I'm not trying to... But, I'm not trying to be sexist, but... Bump the tits out. Yeah, bump the... No. Tits. Um, um, but if you can make graphics like that, you can just make tour graphics like that, right? Yeah. Like fire on my artist right now. I'm going to fire. I used to type in French shop, fire. Milwaukee. That's why you have that Dahmer thing. Bro. Interesting. That, that's like bad idea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, well, this corporate. Rogan one really taking it. It's taking too long, huh? Yeah, I don't know. If it's the computer's work. all shit. Mm -hmm. Well, that's cool. That I don't know. I don't know. So they used that as a cover for real, and it came out. Yeah, oh, I wow. don't like the direction. Where I don't like fucking electric cars. I don't like this AI mm. bullshit. I don't like metaverse. I don't like any of it. I don't sound mm. old. I don't fuck with any of it. Nah, but metaverse had its thing, and now it's apparently Eating like shit. nobody's doing it. And also, even the NFTs, it's like they went down ninety-seven percent. The sale. Did you see uh, Logan Paul sold an NFT for five million? That's worth like three bucks. He what? Sold it, what? Sold it like months before it crashed. They showed his NFT now is worth three dollars. Not three. The, but not his anymore. He sold it. It's worth three dollars. It's, it's super low. It says uh, ten. God damn it. Ten dollars. Wait a minute. Hold on. Let me see this. God damn it. Make sure that thing goes away. I hate that thing. The NFT that <laughs> Logan Paul bought for six dollars over ten dollars. He sold it. Uh, this one he's keeping. Oh, pages are now it's worth ten dollars. Crazy, right? What, he said this. I never Hold bought on. into. What did he this say? An NFT. What does he say? An NFT. I bought for sixty. Six hundred. Come on. Yeah, the market is crashed like crypto too. That like bad? It crashed. It crashed. Yeah. Holy fucking shit! The guy that sold to him's all. Ugh. So did he? So he has it. He didn't sell it. I don't know. What is for some fucking, reason? I, I know there's another. He had another I knew thing. that was going to be a fucking stupid fact. Me too. And Callan was. Remember, Callan was trying to get us on those. Uh, Callan's NFT got the worst monkeys. business ideas. Oh, he, I was like, please don't make me invest in this. Oh, such a bad. He's like, business dude, idea. We'll, we'll do NFT monkeys, and we'll all buy them, promote them on the show. People will buy them, and they it goes up in value. He doesn't know what the fuck he's talking <laughs> no. about. And he's yeah. just like, he hears something's working. I was working like, you don't like, know how to turn Bluetooth Let's be Guy on. Fieri. You're like, what? I was like, you don't know how to turn Bluetooth on your phone. I know. Why dude. are you pitching me NFTs right now? All that stuff, though. Crypt, like, crypto's way down. Way down. That one dude, he was even called, like, the crypto center or whatever. They have to take the name off because he can't afford it anymore. All that shit. Did you have crypto? No. I don't fuck with I any had of that some. stuff. None of that stuff. I lost, like... Well, there's that one guy who bought a pizza. He, paid, he used like whatever ten cryptos at the time is worth. They said, in the height of crypto, is he paid like six million dollars for that pizza? That's hilarious. <laughs> I bought. Let's see, what do I lose? I lost. Uh, the cryptocurrency's dicey too because the government, right? Twelve thousand dollars. Do their thing on crypto. Lost twelve grand. Probably, yeah, maybe on this crypto. I didn't. Even, but I didn't know. I, well, actually, probably didn't lose that much because it went up. And then went back down. Yeah, so probably put, I don't know, let's yeah. say two grand. It went up I might 12. have lost a little bit, yeah. But, but yeah, watching it go. I didn't even check it for months. And then I looked and I was like, oh, fuck. Whatever, dude. Hey, Dogecoin could go back up. Never Dogecoin know. to the moon. <laughs> Dogecoin to the moon. You never know, dog. Yeah. I think it's funny what Elon's been doing with Twitter, right? With the, you know, he's figuring it out. It's a bit of a shit storm, especially if you go online and everyone wants to shit on him, especially the left. Mm. But he's doing some good things, getting rid of all the bullshit with the, you know, you have to pay for ver verifications for the mm -hmm. blue check mark. Yeah. But people are buying the blue check mark, like legit businesses. Someone bought the OJ, and I forget, like OJ's actual one is like the real OJ Simpson. Mm -hmm. Someone bought OJ Simpson, got verified. First post put, not going to lie, fucking did it. <laughs> Oh my and then God. people think it's real, and it's just like 30,000 yeah, yeah. retweets, you know? Yeah. Elon's like, okay, we got to figure this I out. Know. Wow. He's doing cool shit on there, though. Is he? I have known nothing about because it. Because uh, he got on there and was like, hey, we, wanna, we want content creators to come back to Twitter for mm. content. He was like, we're going to allow two 40-minute, 40 42-minute long videos now. So you can post podcast, like full podcasts on there. What? You post a special on there. And then also monetization. There it is, dude. Look at Joe Rogan as Superman. Well, that's Joe, the guy on the top left, Joe Rogan with 
you know, downs, right? What the fuck? I draw, but why doesn't I draw it look like Joe Rogan? That's the thing. I, I, I don't under. This is a very primitive version of it. Yeah. The one that people are on the wait list would probably do it better. But uh, there's okay, a go to other, go to the bottom right one. Like, why is that even one? <laughs> that looks that's, like a dog. That's so weird. And then the other one looks like he, if he's a burn victim. <laughs> well, they all kind of look like that. Yeah. Instead of the flag in the background. Yeah, that's hilarious. Oh, that's funny. What, what, yeah, the what, middle what, one looks the, like a burn victim. Yeah. Those are awful. Oh, wow. Hilarious. It'll just be Paul Gasol. <laughs> Chris D'Elia in the NBA. Here we go. Should not take long. Up to two minutes. Oh, good. That's way better. At least it's giving us a time. to. Oh, and there's a ticker on there, too. I I've never even heard of this. Am I old school? I, I've heard of it. Heard? I, I didn't know it's called Dolly, but I've heard of it. Yeah, people. I think the guy used something else that he sent those bikers in. Oh. Um, I'm waiting to hear back from him, but those are pretty funny. Eric Griffin's the best. Yeah. The Steven Seagal. Steven Seagal. Mm-hmm. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh this looks nothing oh, wow. like you. Click on well, I mean, that one doesn't even have a face in it. There we go. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> I and mean, why are your hands in your pants? Terrifying. Oh, why is it hitting the pants? Off. <laughs> 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 it's hilarious. Let's get this on a t-shirt. That yeah. thing is awful. But go go to more. Let me see the other ones. They don't have your none of them have your face. That's weird. They don't have your well, the bottom left does. It's this. This is the oh. worst graphics I've ever seen. Graphics. Did you put it on? Why what is would it, you call it art? I don't know. Maybe it's because apostrophe is not in it. AI graphics. Maybe it's because the apostrophe is not in the D E L I A. Do it. Well, I was gonna say, does that have to be someone like super mainstream? But Rogan's pretty fucking mainstream, so I, his was. Yeah, no, it's terrible. Yeah, not good. What's up, big dog? What up, bitch? Yeah, say hi to this guy. What up, hey, bitch? Boys, relax. No, 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 don't call me that. Oh, no, what's no, up, no, bitch? What's up, you old bitch? What's up, you old bitches? Okay, listen up. I just finished acting, so I'm a little on edge, and my, my nerves are raw, and I'm I'm an actor. Yeah, what, so what, what, I'm in what, still. what, what bald guy did you play? <laughs> Dude, I will burst into tears right now. Hey, I'm hey. gonna cry. Hey, B, is it uh, Black Panther 3? You're the white villain? The old white villain? Yes, I'm the white villain. Yes, hey, Callan. You must know. Callan, how did they age you like that for this part? Bro. I like the makeup. Are, bro, watch your step because your, your, your hands will be super full with me. Jimmy! Oh. oh. Jimmy Schubert. The what's up, Jimmy, Jimmy, what's up, dude? What's up, Chris? How are you, buddy? Hey, Chris. Hey, Chris. Good, buddy. That's a come. That's a comic. All right, dude. I know I'm. we're all comics, all right? Don't be like, yeah, but you're saying it like I'm got, not. Got, and I don't know if you guys noticed, but Brian Coward is a methadone actor. <laughs> <laughs> methadone actor. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Boys, you, boys. You've been stupid. <laughs> dude, they've had uh, sag reps were all over the set today. <laughs> Kids, PG-13, kept saying. The SAG rep had to show up. Yeah, I, <laughs> I don't bet. Really get that, but anyway, you know what I mean. So. I bet it, I bet, I bet. Dude, hey, hey, Brian, look, yeah. w- w- how's it going over there in, in Detroit? How's it going over there in Detroit? What's it like? Tell us what it's like for you. Well, you know what, guys? It's a little rainy, but that's what's to be expected in, in Detroit in November. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, that's not well, interesting. That's not interesting. You know, we're blessed. We're blessed to be working. No, and, uh, do, be lives, real with us. Lives. Be real with us. I am. I'm being real. I guess uh, at the end of the day, you just put your nose to the grindstone. No. And God to damn it! Man. To be the best way you know how. I mean, is that? I don't know what else I can I can say. Uh, but we are lucky, and we're having a great. God time. damn oh, it, God. dude! Uh, our job is just to come together. I'll tell you, I'm working with an amazing. Team. No, you're you're, you're being really annoying. Like, no. This is a good morning, America. God sakes. No, no, no. But I mean, I would say at the end of the day, if you're bored, put on man. Tears, which is my special on oh YouTube. god you've oh, been promoting you've been promoting free. it for two months and, though yeah it's been really taking the uh, internet by storm i have to thank all the fans who've really gone pretty rabid about it and i'm watching it three four or five and sometimes seven eight times and that's pretty <laughs> exactly. very, humble, very blessed and uh, and i want to thank you guys for helping me out and uh, for all my friends here for all the support so well, they are. you know truth be told my back is killing me carrying this movie <laughs> <laughs> I believe it. <laughs> there it is. I believe it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's, it's, 
true. Jimmy's done a, a great job. He's really uh, hitting his mark and telling the truth, as uh, James Cagney said once, right? Uh, I guess oh, so, God. man. I don't know. And, and are you guys headed to... Hey, B, are you guys headed What's to that? Holiday Inn now? Where the yeah. are you staying? You headed to Red Roof Inn? You, you know, oh, no, even worse. Yeah, even worse. No, no, worse. No, no, we, got our own, we got our own condos. We got our own condos, our own apartments. We flew here on Spirit. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> right. Wow. Yep. Nightmare. We're going to get together, get a little workout in, take a sauna, and then... And then uh, we're going to go to the House of Comedy and put on a show. We work eight hours on the movie set, and now we're going to do some comedy at the House of Comedy here in Detroit. Oh, that'll be a good right. show. That's, That's right. what we do. That'll, that'll be, be funny good show. shit, dude. Wrong. That's a good show right there. I'm jealous. Ka- Brian Callen can open. He'll do five. He'll do five minutes. <laughs> no, no, no. And then when they're on stage, you <laughs> and then when they're on stage, you take the orders from the crowd. Hey, Brian. No, no, make, no, make, 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 hey, B. Make sure you do that when you uh, talk like a black guy in Detroit. Let's let, let's know how that goes <laughs> for you. <laughs> Well, you know what? What you know what it is? I'm a, I'm a chameleon, and I, I know how to speak uh, a lot of different languages. God, what <laughs> if they just got I, whatever I got to do to endear myself to the uh, general populace? Jimmy's uh, Jimmy's texting me right now. Tell Brian to shut the fuck up, dude. <laughs> um, <laughs> the uh, yo, how about what if they just crashed to their death right now? <laughs> They would do and numbies. They would do numbers. It would say Jimmy Schubert. Do you want to be? <laughs> That's probably true. That's Jimmy probably Schubert true. and friends. <laughs> and friends. Jimmy Schubert and friends. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Well. Yeah, that's a that's a pretty unique set, guys. What do you do? Just stare at the camera and yeah. Talk about sports. Yeah, we're changing the game. Yeah, dude. It's a sports show. Um, we're on OnlyFans. Well, we wanted to talk to Eric, but we got Brian, and that's okay. <laughs> oh, I'm, crying, I'm, so, I'm so sorry. You know what I mean? It no, is it's what okay. It is. I that's hope you that, guys are holding that, you down. That's all the time we yeah. have, though, dude. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, dude, sorry. We got to cut it now. So that's our program. Just mid sentence, you cut me off. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Still doing it all the way from here, yeah, my yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, all right, dude. Well, right. We miss you, brother. Yeah, I miss I you, man. And uh, good to see yeah, all you guys. Man. Have fun on your show we'll tonight. We'll see you soon, Eric. Woo, woo, woo. Bring a gift next week for gift exchange. Woo, woo, woo. Woo, woo, woo. See, see how I do it right, with them? Later, later, guys. Damn, that. They're old, huh? Record. Yeah, that made me feel so good. Just to freaking be bullshitting with them like that. Yeah. I love bullshitting. I man. wish I was there. That made me feel good. I bet you. Oh, wow. Oh, Brendan Shop is a bullfight. <laughs> well, yours is the best one. No, it's Yeah, it not. is. I mean, oh no, there's no mistake that that's, that's me you. as a warthog, dude. <laughs> that's you. When, why is Yours the, or at least you. Why, why is he a bullfighter in the UFC octagon? In Look at the bottom middle. Ew. That's call, you have cauliflower face. God. <laughs> the top left is... <laughs> oh, that's the most... Oh, that looks God. like you. Yeah, that's you. Go bottom left. Go bottom left. With, <laughs> what the Love fuck? Love on Picasso. the spectrum. <laughs> Look at the tattoo. That's hilarious. Wow. All right. Well, well. Thanks for listening, you guys. I'm gonna be will in be my nightmare. Lake, Lake, yeah, Lakeland, Florida, Lakeland, Florida, San Diego, San Diego, California, Lakeland, Florida, uh, Portland, Oregon, uh, Seattle, um, Jacksonville, Austin, Tulsa, a bunch more. Go to chrislea.com. So I think I'm in uh, D.C. as we're shooting this, December 15th through the 17th, D.C. Improv, right? I yes. mean, so Guys. insecure, has no idea. No, all good. Uh, the, 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 the dates are all weird. <laughs> 15, 16, 17. Yes, DC Improv, my favorite clubs. DC Improv. Naples, you're in Naples Tom tonight. Kamala Harris is open up for me. DC wow. uh, is this Friday, Saturday. Get you some. Uh, thickboy.com. All right, kids. Love you. Appreciate you guys. We're friends that laugh. We're friends that shout. Sometimes we don't know what we're talking about.